The Birth of Esau and Jacob Jacob was the son of Abraham, and he was forty years old when he married Rebekah, the daughter of Bethuel. She was also the sister of Laban, the Aramean from northern Syria. Almost twenty years later, Rebekah still had no children, so Isaac asked the Lord to let her have a child, and the Lord answered his prayer. Before Rebekah gave birth, she knew she was going to have twins because she could feel them inside her fighting each other. She thought, why is this happening to me? Finally, she asked the Lord why her twins were fighting, and he told her, Your two sons will become two separate nations. The younger of the two will be stronger, and the elder son will be his servant. When Rebekah gave birth, the first baby was covered with red hair, so he was named Esau. The second baby grabbed his brother's heel, so they named him Jacob. Isaac was sixty years old when they were born. As Jacob and Esau grew older, Esau liked the outdoors and became a good hunter, while Jacob settled down and became a shepherd. Esau would take the meat of wild animals to his father Isaac, so Isaac loved him more, but Jacob was his mother's favourite son. One day Jacob was cooking some stew when Esau came home hungry and said, I'm starving to death. Give me some of that red stew at once. And that's how Esau got the name Edom. Jacob replied, Sell me your rights as the firstborn son. I'm about to die, Esau answered. What good will those rights do me? But Jacob said, Promise me your birthright here and now. And that's what Esau did. Jacob then gave Esau some bread and some of the bean stew. And when Esau had finished eating and drinking, he just got up and left, showing how little he thought of his rights as the firstborn.